Back again, Harry? My first scene with Taras, he came on and he introduced himself. <laughs> that was quite scary at first because there are quite a lot of people who've worked with him before and you've heard things and you're like, oh, OK, OK. But when he gets on set, you're like, OK, um, OK, you're quite frightening. Yeah. I'm going to go over here. I do not need a cloak to become invisible, Harry. When it came time to cast Dumbledore, we needed a father figure who had a sense of mischief and had a twinkle in his eye. So we thought Richard would be a perfect Dumbledore. Let me give you a clue. And Richard, by the way, um, is my, my godfather. My father used to be his agent. He was his best friend. So Richard was a very significant part of my life growing up. And he was a true eccentric, a real character, a larger-than-life character, and that was what you wanted Dumbledore to be. Most what? Desperate. Most desperate desires of the heart. <laughs> well done, Richard. I remember Dave and I going to dinner with Richard, and he was reluctant to play the role. I must admit that I mean, it took me months to say yes to it. I wasn't necessarily very keen on doing it. What really sold it was not me. I wish I could claim such power, but no, it wasn't me. It was the fact that his granddaughter, Ella, read the books. Granddaughter called me and said, Papa, she said, if you don't play Dumbledore, I will never speak to you again. And he said, OK, I'll do it, I'll do it. She's wrapped up in it, you know, and I love the book, I love the script. It's beautifully written and beautiful, beautiful dialogue in it. I see that you, like many before you, have discovered the delights of the mirror of Arisad. In hiring a writer. We wanted somebody who could capture the spirit of Joe's writing. And so I sent the book out to a few writers. But I had around, I can't remember, seven first editions of Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone, which I sent out to many writers who passed on it. Each one of those books is worth like $25,000 now, so the screenwriters who didn't do the, the book ended up getting paid anyway.